Hello and welcome. What is OBS Ninja? It's a new one. They've got OBS. They've got Streamlabs OBS. But why do you need OBS Ninja? Well, to be honest with you, it's something really great. What I'm going to do is share a few points with you and let you know exactly what it is and what you can do with it. So OBS Ninja is an additional thing to OBS. So it's not a new OBS or a replacement. It brings live video from your smartphone and your computer or other friends' mobiles directly into OBS. So when you add a source in OBS, like a camera, you could add another source in wirelessly. You can wireless, you can wireless live stream from your phone to your computer. So if I had my mobile phone, what I could do with this phone is send a link from the computer to my phone similar to how you do with Streamlabs. You can use the link and the phone becomes a webcam via Wi-Fi or mobile data. So if I was out and about and I had to attend a meeting, that link could be sent to me and I could do it via my phone. So there's a few options there. It includes audio and video, which is an excellent thing. How to make your smartphone a wireless webcam for live streaming. I'm going to show you how to set it up and look into the the functions of it and how you can make benefit of it. You can share video and audio from your smartphone to your computer wirelessly. Remember, this is going to be a source added to your computer. So you'll still need your main computer, but you can have a tablet, a mobile phone, uh, some of the old Apple iPods, Mac computers, any type of computer will work. It works through a browser, so the website. So that's why it works. You can add it as a remote video source to live streams. Pull in other people's videos and audio into your own podcast or live session. So, for example, if I was live streaming right now, I could have sent that link out to someone and they could join me and I could put them into OBS. How amazing is that? So, what I'll do is I'll cover a few more pointers about this and make this a complete guide. This is your overview of what OBS Ninja is. Uh, how to use OBS Ninja with OBS Studio. You can see I like what they did with the logo. See, notice there the logo they got. That's the old OBS and this one they made into a bit of a ninja star. So well done. Uh, big shout out to Steve from Reddit. He's one of the guys doing the development on it. So I picked it up from there. It's been out for about four months and they're still doing work on it. But I think it's something to keep an eye on. And watch out StreamYards and Zoom and everybody else. These guys are making something interesting. So the next video in my playlist will be about how to set it up. And I'll link you to that.